Hallelujah. Glory be to God in the highest. Church, I'd like us to rise on our feet. Let's lift up our voice to our Father and our God. He's been fought 39 days of prayer and fasting waiting on God. It's my first time of doing 40 days. Hallelujah. I've done 21 over and over, but today is the 39th day. It's my first time. <laughs> Hey, I know my life will never be remain the same again. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you for tonight. We give you praise as a church. We thank you, God, for what you are said to do in 2021. Thank you for the answered prayers. Thank you for the ends you've done already. Thank you for revelations. Thank you for counsel. Thank you for guidance. Thank you, God, in the name of Jesus. We give you praise. We exalt your holy name. We worship you, oh God. Go ahead and give you praise. Ya katala brakada. Jeke teke teke leka tuku loko doke deke de. Jesus said to his disciples, he said, I go to my father and to your father and to my God and to your God. Ya katele brake de. Ja kateke leke do shada brakada. Father, we thank you. We give you praise. We give you praise. We thank you, oh God, for direction. Thank you for guidance. Thank you for revelation. Thank you for fresh visions. Thank you for strength in the name of Jesus. Thank you for what you are set to do in 2021 and beyond in our lives, in our church, in our destinies, in our families. Father, we thank you. We give you praise. We exalt your holy name. Our Father, we thank you. Glory be to your name, O oh God. Glory be to your name, O oh God. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I'd like us to open our Bible to John ch chapter 10. Of John chapter 10 from verse 4. We we'll read 4 and 5. I want us to pray for divine guidance for 2021 and for the rest of our life. Hallelujah. I like us to pray for divine guidance. Verse 4, he said, And when he put forth his own sheep, he went before them, and the sheep followed him, for they know his voice. And a stranger will they not follow, but will flee from him, for they know not the voice of strangers. Hallelujah. So I want us to lift up our voice this evening, and we we'll begin to pray in tongues for divine guidance that in 2021 and beyond that the Lord will lead us as a church in the name of Jesus he will lead us as individuals we will not make mistakes in the name of Jesus we will follow instructions lift up your voice and stand on your feet and pray the Bible said that Elias was a man of like passion like we are and he prayed that it will not rain and it didn't rain he prayed again and it rained. Hallelujah. Ya katande le brekede. Je kateka la katoshe do brekede. Aga teke 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 la kada 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 kada. Je da bada 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 kada kada kada. Father, we come before you as a church, as individuals. We pray for 2021 and beyond that you will guide us. We will not miss me, Mark. In the name of Jesus, we will not take the wrong step. We will not walk with the wrong people. We will not be finding the wrong company. In the name of Jesus, we will not make mistakes. We will not make, take wrong decisions. We will not take wrong turn in our lives and destiny. In the name of Jesus, ya katande le brekede, ya kateke teke 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 legede, aga teke legede kedeza. As we go, we we'll hear your voice, O oh God, from behind saying to us, Turn right, turn left, go this way, talk to this person, take this step, do this in the name of Jesus. Lord, we will not go where you do, where you do not dwell in the name of Jesus. We will only be where you are, O oh God, by time and season from today, henceforth, 2021 
and beyond and the rest of our life in the name of Jesus. Yakata na brega, yakate kete kete kelegede, agate kete kelegede kelegede, jede bede bede brega, yakato koto kelegede, ambra kato koto koto, vekete kete kelegede, ajakate sa zabada bada bada brega, jada bande egete kete kelegede. Bible said that as many as are led by the Spirit of God, they are the sons of God. Romans eight sixteen. Yakata na brega, jekate kete kele. Now this is our desire for the rest of our life that will be relayed, O oh God, by Your Spirit. In the name of Jesus, we will not hear the voice of strangers. We will not follow strangers, O oh God. We will be led by You and You alone. Yakata ndele brega. Ezeketo koto kologoda, jada bada bada bragada, jada bada bragada, jaka te ke te ke te, ekato kologoda, jada bada bada bragada, jaka te eke te ke te ke lagada, jada bada bada bragada sa, aga te ke te ke te ke le, ezede bede bede bragada, jada bada bada bragada, jaka te ke te ke lagada, aga to kologoda kere kere, jede bede bede bragada, jeke te ke te ke te ke te, ambre koto sa, zabada bada bada bragada, jaka te ke Teka teka le ayagata kata 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 ambre kete 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 yegedesa zede bede 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 zede bede 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 we are divinely led in the name of Jesus we will not miss the mark of God we will not break rank everyone maintaining their assignment everyone maintaining their lane in the name of Jesus thank you Father in Jesus name we are prayed. Hallelujah. I want us to open to Isaiah 55. We will pray for tongues of fire. Hallelujah. I want you to pray fervently, oh God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. The Bible said that the effectual fervent prayer of a righteous man makes tremendous power available. That is dynamic in his work in effectual. The Bible said that Elijah put his leg in between his knees and he prayed for hours. Hallelujah. Isaiah 55 from verse 1 I, One man preached it and I fell in love with it The whole everyone that tested Come ye to the waters And he that had no money Come ye buy and eat Yea come buy wine and make without money Without price Hallelujah I want us to pray that the experience At the conference Starting the 8th of March To the 14th of March Will be an opportunity for people to buy In the name of Jesus Many will buy child, child bearing. Many will buy husband without money. Many will come to clarity of their vision, clarity of their purpose. So many of us will come to understand exactly what God has called us to do in the name of Jesus. That it will be indeed the new move of the Holy Ghost. Go ahead and pray. Father, we yield to you. We say, take hold our vocal calls. Pray through us. Let your will be done in those minutes in the name of Jesus. Beginning Monday evening or through Sunday afternoon, let your will be done. Let revelation be communicated like never before. Let there be a fresh outpour of your spirit upon everyone. Let the minister speak words in season to every weary soul. Let there be a bending of new visions, new revelations in the name of Jesus. May our nations of the world not remain the same. May ministries be transformed in the name of Jesus. Lord, stretch forth your hand to heal, O God, by the name of your holy child Jesus. That miracles will be done. The blind will see, the lame will walk, the dumb will speak. Those who are spiritually blind will receive their sight. Those who are dull of hearing spiritually will receive their ear back, their hearing back. In the name of Jesus, the heart of men will conceive nation transforming visions. In the name of Jesus, we pray, O oh God, by this conference, 
the 11th annual convention, Lord, in the name of Jesus, you will reposition world changes as a nation ruling church in the name of Jesus. An army of men and women will be raised in this church in the name of Jesus. Men and women who will not break rank. The heart will be sold out to God like never before. Burning with fire. Committed to the call of God upon this house. Men and women who be sent out to the nations of the world as explosives causing change. Men and will rule in the political sphere in the name of Jesus, in the business world, in the financial world, in the academic world, in the medical world, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus. I'd like you to lift up your hands, right hand with me. And say, Father, we thank you. As a church, we call forth men from all over Nairobi, all over East Africa, all over the world, men of all races, of all colors, as members of World Changers, International Christian Center, in the name of Jesus. We declare that they are coming with their resources. They come with their wealth. They come with their heart prepared for the things of God. In the name of Jesus, we call for the unchurched. We call for the unsaved. We call for the destitute. We call for the high and mighty. Men that are creatively gifted. Men of influence in the society. In the name of Jesus. They are coming to us now. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you. We give you all the praise and glory. We thank you, Father, because your word says the end of a matter is better than the beginning thereof. Father, we thank you because, you, because of this uh, end, Lord, of uh, the 40 days prayer and fasting. We thank you, Lord, because tonight, Lord, we shall finish strong. And Lord, my Father, we shall enter, Lord, into greater heights for the glory and honor of your name. Father, we thank you and I give you all the praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's sing hymn number 41, page 20, Higher Ground. I'm pressing on the upward way, new heights I'm gaining every day, still praying as I'm onward bound. Lord, plant my feet on high ground. Lord, lift me up and let me stay. I feel on earth and feel on earth. A higher place than I have found. Lord, plant my feet on higher ground. My heart has no desire to stay Where doubts arise and fears dismay Those are me dwell where those are bound My prayer, my head is I am God Don't lift me up, don't lift me up And let me stand I feel on heaven, feel on a higher place than I have found. Lord, plant my feet on higher ground. I want to live above the world, do set and judge at me around. For faith has caught that joyful sound, that song of saints on higher ground. Lord, lift me up, Lord, lift me up, and let me stand. Thy feet 
Ecclesiastes chapter 7 verse number 8 let your keyboard be under and whoever is in the studio always type the songs and put there so that those who are watching from other nations can read it and understand it since we are singing in Kiswahili Kelvin fix this TV well always be attentive to details make sure it's bright and clear Ecclesiastes 7 verse number 8 the Bible says better is the end of a thing than the beginning thereof better is the end of a thing and we are ending the fast better is the end of a thing in the next few hours we are on the 40th day and we are fine the almighty God have answered you better is the end of a thing than the beginning thereof alright Ezekiel chapter 36 verse 11 you are full of mercy and grace coming down upon us you are full of mercy and grace you put it down upon us I see the earth said I will multiply upon you man and beast and they shall increase and bring fruit and I will say to you after your own estates and will do better unto you than at the beginning and you shall know I am the Lord my emphasis is that I will do better unto you than at the beginning I will do better to you than when you started this year will end well in the name of Jesus Christ and as this fasting is ending well so this year will end well in your life in the name of Jesus Christ each month will end well if you can hold this word this one and I will do better unto you than at the beginning hold it as a rema word in your life hold it as a rema word every end of the month you put it that God will do better to me than when the month began see I'm telling you that's where I walk how do I explain to you? That's why I do it. <laughs> I pick out the word and I hold it and it works for me. So at the end of every month, it will be better than the, when the month began. Have you understood it? Whenever you are finishing in a place, you finish there well because of this scripture. Because it's always better than at the beginning. When we are living in Gara, we left better than we came there. We left there fine, blessed. We left there to our own land. Anywhere you enter into, you live there better than when you came. When I entered into Scotland, I lived there better than when I came there. I lived there finer, richer, blessed. People are happier than I came. Oh, glory to God. When I went to India, I lived there better than when I came. Oh, glory to God. That's how it should be. So anywhere you are living, it should be better at the end than at the beginning. And you should also note that the devil fights your end. Because he doesn't want it to be better for you. But better is the end of a thing than at the beginning. So what he does is wait for you at the end to disgrace you. <laughs> so understand the strategy of the enemy. He waits at the end to spoil all that you have been And that's the need for prayers. Many people, towards their end, the devil spoils all that they've labored for. If you're not careful to note that that's the way of it. Look at Elijah. Elijah called down fire from heaven. Arrested all the prophets of Baal, killed all of them, prayed again, rain fell everywhere. He ran faster than the chariot. As soon as that episode was ended, Jezebel said, I'm going to kill you. Have you seen that? Jezebel said, I'll finish you. 
the devil attacks at the end because he knows it should be better for you at the end. So he waits for you at the end to disgrace you, to embarrass you, to make your mission unsuccessful, to spoil all that God has done for you. First of all, I want us to thank God now. In the name of God, I thank you because it will forever be better for me at the end than at the beginning. It will forever. It will become a, a lifestyle. It will always be better for me at the end than at the beginning. On your mark, said, go ahead, prophesy it. Speak it out. Speak it out. Turn it to your word. It will always be better for me at the end than when I began in the name of Jesus. Always be better for me at the end. It will always be better for me at the end than when I began. It will always be. It will always be better for me at the end. Mareka Taka Braka Doshe Garusa. Always it will be better for me at the end than when I began. It will always be better for me at the end. Maseka Laga Braka Dusha. It will always be better for me at the end than at the beginning. Always. Masoka Laga Braka Dusha Handa Lekaraba. Oreka Taka Braka. Anywhere I enter, it will always be better for me at the end than at the beginning. Always. Father, I make it a covenant. I make it a covenant over my life. I make it a law over my destiny. I make it a rule over my life. It will always be better for me at the end than at my beginning. The end of this fast is better than when we began. The end of this fasting and prayer is better than when we began. We are so grateful, oh God. It's better for us in this ministry at the end of the fast than when we began. Thank you, Lord Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. I want you to now decree every enemy waiting for me at the end. I embarrass you from the beginning. I disgrace you from the beginning. Clap your hands and fire that prayer. Every enemy waiting for me at the end. I disgrace you at the beginning. I embarrass you. I disgrace you. I disgrace you. I disgrace you. I disgrace you at the beginning. I embarrass you. I embarrass you. I disgrace you. In the mighty name of Jesus, I embarrass you. I disgrace you. From the beginning, you are already embarrassed. Let it be so. Iko tu kabra kado shegarusa, mareka taka kabra kado shegarwa, maseka tata lika du shegarusa, mareka taka kabra kado shegarwa, eka toko bogorwa, maleka daga kabra kado shegarwa. Let it be so, oh God. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Our Father, we thank you for helping us. Thirty-nine days into the fortieth day. We are very grateful. Thank you for your divine assistance. Thank you, mighty Father. Show yourself mighty this night as we round off this session. And then let the answers begin to show up. And Lord, I ask, O oh God, that the word you have given to us, that the end will always be better, that you do better to us at the end than at the beginning. Confirm it with signs following. And let this year end so well, so well that we can't even believe what we are going to see. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Everybody say, Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Tonight, as we're winding up, we're bringing up Pastor God's power. Because after this ministration, he will be in the next jet back to Lagos, Nigeria. He had been a blessing to us. May God remember him. But I will allow him minister. Then I'll come up to speak. And pray for him. Join me, ladies and gentlemen, to receive Pastor God's power, Onu Oha, as he brings us the word of God. Praise the Lord. Apostle, can you help me with this song? Clap for me now. Oh, <laughs> 
together and give the Lord a shout. 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 with wings as eagles and your flight has begun you have mounted with wings as eagles and your flight has begun you have mounted with wings as eagles and your flight has begun mark this you will not fly in low places you will fly above the storms you will fly above the mountains you will fly above the storms and you will fly above the mountains you may not and you cannot fathom where i'm taking you to but the journey has begun you are unstoppable you are unstoppable you are unstoppable i chose to give you the wings because i've been waiting for you to come and now i will make the world know that you waited on me and that i've called you and sent you to this land. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Keep on this place, don't stop. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I see pockets of promotions here and there. I see pockets of promotions. You know, individual experiences of promotions. You see, some of you may not be under unemployment, but yet you're going to get promotion. God takes you beyond your capacity for now. Takes you beyond what your expectation is presently. Takes you beyond what your level is presently. Promotion, promotion. Not the kind that man gives. Kalabodo shanta barada. A sika tula barazo bekenia. I see peace in a troubled land. A palada subre katabazalia. I see peace in a troubled land. You be toiling and toiling and toiling. But God said the time for you to fly has come. <laughs> oh God, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I, I hear God saying someone is going to come to a position of power. A position of power. Someone is going to come to a position of power where you will become an influencer. In Kata, where you become an influencer. Zibolo shakata baragada, zika dada kuta galada, eziko po sienda gada. I, the Lord, will perform it in His time. Hey, kabo shogo no kushida. Hey. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, 
age-long battles the end has come age-long battle the end has come Age long battle, the end has come. For the Egyptians you saw yesterday, you shall see them no more. Behold, it's a new beginning. It's a new beginning. It's a new beginning. I will amaze you. I will amaze you. It's a new beginning. The Egyptians you saw that you have formed and seen as part of your life, their end has come. This is a new chapter. For what changes, a new chapter has begun. <laughs> Pastor, you read a scripture from Isaiah 36 and 37 where he says, I will yet do greater. God is saying that scripture is for you. Now, what you think that God has done within this period of moving in here is nothing compared to what he's about to do. Now, you have seen nothing yet. You're taking that scripture is for the people. God is saying for you. You are saying God has done great things. He said, but this is nothing compared to what I'm said to do. I am only rehearsing with you. Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> I will gather your seed that is scattered from the east, from the west, from the south, from the north. I will gather them. I will gather them. I will gather them. And this place shall yet be inhabited. And there shall be no room anymore. <laughs> Zembro, is anybody in the media? Legazo porosutosia. Isaiah 49 20. Shikebo zuza gata kuzu. Egros kina mo zumbre gezekle bo zumbre gede 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 za. Yokotos. Is it on the screen? The children which thou shalt have after thou hast lost the order shall say again in thy ears. The place is too straight for me. Give place to me that I may dwell. That's the word, sir. That's the word, sir. Maybe I should have shared, but those who are watching. Whatever you have lost that would have affected you your expectations that were not met the desires that seem not to be granted where you have positioned yourself in your mind that exactly you're not seeing yourself being there God is saying what I'm about to do will be much more than what you lost that even what you are having now and what looks like a greatness or blessings that God has put on you will be too small now what is coming will tell you let us expand let's look for more room he said the place is too straight that's what they will say too straight too tiny too small uh, how many overflows do we have three it won't be enough sir i'm not speaking by myself it won't be enough sir they will say this place is too small for us Give us place so we can expand and enlarge. Kalebo shanti yende hezekuta. Eziala koroto si mrezikla para kuso tohila ziya badogada. E katandolo subre e grebutu sikada. Even there are some people here, one, two people. The, the position you are right now, even in your physical place of work, you know you are due for something much more than that. 
but somehow you were contented because of what is coming say ah, if i didn't see this one uncle but god is saying listen to me this year 2021 if i have sent this man to you this is god speaking i will make it come to pass your promotion shall not be once it shall be doubled beyond what you even imagine in the name of jesus christ you may not know this song but that's what the angels of God are bringing and singing I'm hearing them Kilo Kilo lift up your hands everyone Kilo Wherever you are, just pick up those hands to heaven. Something is happening right now. A transition is taking place. A transition is taking place. God is changing seasons for men. God is changing seasons for men. I will walk and walk in your days. I will walk and walk in your days. That even when you are told, you will begin to argue. What, how? 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 Mary said, How can this thing be? I see a miracle of how can this thing be? Coming upon the head of someone here. I see a miracle of how can this thing be? How can this thing be? Because it looks like a lie. small boy a meat bigger than him he'll ask you for me and who 
God is going to give you meat that you need to ask for me and who. He's going to put you in situations and levels, positions of authority, influence, and power where you begin to ask, am, am I dreaming? Is this real? Is this real? Is this real? Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. One more time, lift up those hands to heaven. Even some of you who don't have the gift of the Spirit, God is about to pour in under some people. The design of the gifts, if you know them, you have understood them before. Receive them right now. Kaladum shike para kuski ne malo kusi brakat kya? Ekule don shabra kame kata 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 don shabra kata. Ezi engo suhasi ya la husi ya ekata busa. Edu kono si braba baba baba. Iye shakata si 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 si. Oriando lihali engo batile kasuba. Ekule su nisa puri ya kikushula. Someone is asking for wisdom and word of knowledge. Receive it now. Let it come upon you now, 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 not tomorrow, now, now. Jesus. For someone here, you cannot shapa legre sule bohoka ibrakata. You are desiring a a, a fiery prayer life. You are saying, God, I wish I can really pray. I desire to come in the place of prayer to acquire power to know You more, Lord. I desire it from tonight. The Spirit of God makes you a partner in the place of prayer. You will see yourself suddenly wake up and begin to speak in tongues. Please, when it comes, don't stop it. Don't stop it. Don't point it. Don't point it. Go ahead and operate in hell. Go ahead and cooperate with the Holy Ghost and pray and you see it as you do it you increase you will increase the holy ghost will take you more and things you couldn't handle you will suddenly begin to handle them god will begin to open your eyes to see you things you were not seeing before that's kept you where you are someone has a need of what may require a such but they've been secretly keeping it to yourself. I don't know what actually it is. But God said to tell you that between now and next tomorrow, you will look for it and you won't find it again. It almost looks like a growth, a trouble you from the inside. You alone know what it is, but you're afraid to tell anybody what it is. But that fear, God has dealt with it right now. You will not go through that surgery. I, I, I heard God say there's someone here you are an entrepreneur you do something you do your business on your own you, you, you work on some things you work, you work on some things you are self-employed you're doing something on your own and what you're doing has to do with life has to do with life and God is saying he said watch this write today sit down I will make you a name in that industry where you are doing that business, that particular thing you're doing, I will make you a name. I will make you a name. Jesus. Ooh. Mm. Someone's business is going to go international here. It's going to go international. I hear that clearly you begin to go to nations of the earth. You will no longer be seated in one place. You begin to go to the nations of the earth. I don't know if the person is here. Can you take it with a loud amen? Hey, Kababa, you were in a place of glory, but Satan brought you down. You're going up again. You are going up again. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Pastor, get ready for this match.
Let's see if we can pray. Please, pray. Please be seated. Be seated. I'll try and rush and do paraphrasing instead of reading verse by verse as we go into the prayers. The first prayer I want us to pray is a prayer that has to do with Samson in the book of um, Judges, chapter 16, the last chapter, second to the last verse. The Bible said, and Samson killed more people at his date than when he was alive. All the people he killed put together were not up to the number he killed when he died. But that's, that's not where I'm going to. Uh, that, that verse said, and when Samson died, his brethren came and carried his body and went and buried him. Samson died and his brethren, I think it's 30, 31 of, second, of, of uh, uh, Judges chapter 16. 30, 31 thereabout. His brethren came and carried his body and the question there is, why didn't the brethren care come while he was imprisoned by the Philistines? Why didn't they come to help him when they gouged out his eyes? His destiny helpers came when he does not need them anymore. I want us to pray. As brief as that is, oh God, may my destiny helpers not come late. Everyone has destiny help as God has wired for you, for your destiny. When God was calling Moses, he already prepared Aaron and Hor, waiting. Everyone has destiny help us that God has already wired, called for you and that destiny. May my destiny help us not come late. Open your mouth and pray that prayer for yourself. Juboro soko to bakadaya. Embre kuto si bakala de zingra bahausa. Elaga do godumbra kada. Jege de borokodusa. E barata sati lo korosia. May my destiny help us not come late. A logo zubre kadaba. A yaga daga do do. Embe kete de kada. Borogo zoko to. May my destiny help us not come late. Maria ndo koso. E pray kadada. Yakata. Can I hear someone pray? A braga duna morosia. E pray kete. Samson was struggling. Samson was in prison. Samson was being suffered. And nobody came to help him. But when he died, they came to carry his body to go and bury him. But one dude was in for Samson that he was buried when he would have lived longer to fulfill his destiny. May my destiny help us not come later in the name of Jesus. Ah, if they use a golden casket to bury Samson, would that be added to the history of Samson? Did he help him to make impact? Has he fulfilled destiny? May your destiny help us not come when you don't need them anymore. Can I hear that? Amen. Amen. The second prayer point. Bible talked about John the Baptist. The Bible said he dwelt in the wilderness until the time of his showing forth. Until the time of his showing forth. Listen to me, sense of God. In every man's life, there's a wilderness time, there's a time of showing forth. Thank you, Jesus. See, while you were coming here every evening, denying yourself of food every day, from January till this date, you were hiding yourself. God had put you in the place of hiding. Hiding. Every other person would have rushed and be doing their things. But you came and hid in the presence of the Lord. I want to tell you, your time of showing up has come. Your time of showing forth has come. And let me tell you something. When God shows you forth, nobody can cover you. I would say you're like a light that is set on a hill. Nobody puts up a candle and cover it with a bushel. When God shows you up, 
Let me tell you what it means to show up. Many of you drive through the streets of Nairobi. You see some showrooms, furniture showrooms. They don't bring furniture that has error to the showroom. Come on, do I have a witness here? They don't bring, if you get to a boutique, the person, the label will not bring any dress that they made an error in the sewing, in the making. They can't bring it to the showroom. It is the best that the manufacturer puts to the showroom. The Bible says God has called us to show forth his praise. Listen to me. God is about to show you. God is about to show you. I want you to pray. Whatever will cover my showing here now. Everything that will cover my showing because my season is now. Whatever will cover my showing up. Tia now. Open your mouth and pray the prayer. Little soto by Yagada. Whatever is ready to cover. Say to cover my showing up. Tia. Every veil of covering. Tagada. Over my showing up season. Tia. Sugadagada. Sugodogoro. Tia. Ekele katata. Yokoto Godosa. Ebragadabala. Asuka Tilia. Ale. Everything is safe to cover. Every veil of covering up. Egabo Robo Sugoda. Over my showing up. Tiana. Tiana. By fire. By fire. She got a tata baba 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 pastor was speaking while he was leading prayers and trying to bring me up giving us a charge he talked about the man called Elijah who killed 400 prophets of Baal on the mountain and after that he began to run from a little witch a female witch, not even a male witch Jezebel the Bible said in this process God caught him he told him okay, you go Go and hide somewhere. And he went and hid by the brook, chariot. Bible said, while he was in the place of hiding, God does not joke with his own. He had to arrange a courier service with an agent to ensure that he never lacked what he needed in the time of that scarcity. A reverend. If you know about reverends or you've tried to study about reverends, Google is your friend. Check it out. Reverends are birds that does not allow anything that belongs to them or any food that they have access to to go to anybody. In fact, what they do is they don't labor to gather foods. They go to where other birds gather their foods. They go and steal it and eat it. And Ravens also feed on flesh like the vulture. They're the same family. Now, the Bible said they will come and carry flesh and bread and bring to the servant of God where he was hiding. God knows your location. God knows your location. It doesn't matter where you're doing that business. God knows your location. But God had to ensure that this career service of the ravens carried food in the morning, breakfast, carried in the evening dinner to the man of God. Nobody even knows. Probably they were even faster to be sure because for them not to eat that food and in the time of scarcity and they carried to go and give the man of God. I want you to pray one prayer. Oh God, even if it means using reverence, in this season we are in the world now that things are looking tight. Oh God, let my reverence bring my resources. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray that prayer for yourself. Let my ravens, let them bring my resources. Wickedness of this world, let it turn to good for me. 
wicked agents of this world let them work for my own good let them serve me for my promotion for my sustenance because that is what god has ordained me for i shall be divinely sustained whatever condition is available i shall be divinely sustained my men shall be saying as a casting down i shall be saying as a lifting up in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The scripture said, I will hasten my word to perform it. I will hasten my word to perform it. Everything God has spoken to us on this mountain, these 40 days of waiting, none shall drop on the ground. The Bible said that the word of Samuel never dropped on the ground. Every word that came out of his mouth came to pass. Every prophetic word, every scripture you have taken as a stone for your Goliath. All these days that you were here, every revelation, every rema you collected to yourself, none of them will remain unfulfilled. Bible said, "Heaven and earth may pass away, but not a jot or a tittle of my word will remain unfulfilled." He says, "Search the scriptures and see, for none of these, that's my words, will fail." He said, "For as the waters that come from the heaven and returning not back empty to heaven," he says, "So is every word that proceeds out of my mouth; it shall accomplish everything I sent it to." God has spoken a word concerning you. You're going to say, my father, my maker. I hold on to my word. The psalmist say, oh Lord, remember your word that has cost me to hope. For your word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Oh Lord, remember your word that has caused me to hope. Every prophetic word that has come over world changes international. Over every member of world changes. Over everyone watching from any part of the world. You are going to pray this prayer. Oh God, none of these words will drop on the ground. I receive the fulfillment of my word. Open your mouth and pray for yourself. I receive the fulfillment of these words. They've been dropping upon me all these 40 days. I receive the fulfillment, my father. I shall not be a watcher. I shall be a partaker. I receive the fulfillment of the manifestation of the scriptures over world changes over their members. Igado Sakataya, Ebele Karagadoka, Iyagada Gadasa, Ebeketekete, every word of internalizer, every word of swallowed, every word, Igadoro Kodogodosa. I receive their manifestation. Lord, in a hurry, 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 not delayed, in a hurry, in a hurry. Iyagada Gadasa, in Jesus' name. Bread. Amen. The Bible was speaking in the book of Ezekiel chapter 12. He said, Son of man, what is this? What is this prophecy? What is this proverb? Sorry. He said, The people are saying concerning you that every vision fails and no, no word comes to pass. He said, Son of man, prophesy and tell them, In your days, every vision will come to pass. Amen. And I tell you what changes. In your days, every word you have had will come to pass. Amen. In your life, it will come to pass. Amen. In this church, it will come to pass. Can I hear you believing? Amen. Amen. I said, in your life, it will come to pass. Amen. In this church, it will come to pass. Amen. In the name of Jesus. A few minutes and I hand over to Apostle. I want us to pray five prayers. Five prayers. Number one, you are going to pray. If you wouldn't mind to sit down, I mean to rise upright, but if you want to sit down, make sure you pray. You're going to lift your right hand up. And you say, World Changers International, let your glory shine. Simple prayer. World Changers International, let your glory shine. Open your mouth and pray that prayer for the depth of your heart. World Changers International, let your glory shine. 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 World Changers International, let your glory shine. Ayaga Baba Baba, let your glory shine. Ebregadegadesha, Ambadagadesha, let your glory shine. Ebrosokotokoto, Ebrakatagadagada, Epakatokotokoto, World Changers let your glory shine. Ebregedo godosa. Epalaga dagada. Hey, Joseph Opalaga. Ebregedo godo. Embrosa gedada. Ebraga dagada. What changes in the national? Let your glory shine. 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 Abraga dagada dagada. Embrogo dogo dogo dogo. Embraga dagada dagada. 
Let your glory shine. Let your glory shine. Let your glory shine. I go to the good. Let your glory shine. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are going to pray yet for world changers. See, we pray the first prayer for ourselves that our destiny helpers will not come late. Every organization has destiny helpers. Everybody has a destiny helper. You're going to pray. World changers, your destiny helpers will locate you now not tomorrow. Your destiny helpers will locate you now. Now, I want to make one thing clear. When we're praying for world changers, world changers is not this building. Praise God. World changers, this gigantic building for building is not world changers. You are world changers. See, when you don't have this understanding, your prayer fire is low. But when you realize that when you're praying for your church, you're praying for yourself. Church of Jesus Christ, this building will not be raptured. It won't be raptured. You are the ones that be raptured. So you are the church. Praise God. So I want you to pray. Your destiny helpers will not come late. Let them come now. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray that prayer. In the name of Jesus. And that wherever they are, let them trace their way. Let them find their way. Ah, Jesus. Every fish God has put a coin in his mouth. Wherever the river is, we command them now. Locate this place. 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 Your fishes with their coins in their mouth. Locate world changers. Locate world changers. Not after. Now. 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 Locate world changers. Alaga dogo dogo dosa. Ah, dosa. Hey, segere segere. Shikata tata baba zeko dogo 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 dogo. Maliki te 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 baba zeko dogo 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 dogo. Shikata tata baba zeko dogo 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 dogo. baba. Hmm. In Jesus name. Hmm. Uh, Daniel prayed and the scripture said the first day Daniel prayed the answers were released how many of us have read that before the first day that Daniel prayed the answers were released but the prince of Persia held the answers on the way. And Daniel continued to pray. And something happened. God didn't say, well, Daniel, even though I know the world is your place, do all your hands, struggle to collect it. Like he said, I've given to you all king of Basha and his land, but battle with him, contend with him in battle to possess your position. But in the case of Daniel, hey Jesus, thank you. God himself sent reinforcement. Sent reinforcement. I want you to pray. Oh my father, the reinforcement needed to sustain this ministry the rapture. Send it in the name of Jesus Christ. Name of Open Jesus. your mouth and pray. The reinforcement needed. Spiritual reinforcement. Physical reinforcement. Emotional reinforcement. Every kind of reinforcement needed to keep this ministry aglow and alive on the rapture. Send it, oh God. They have no go to Saga. They have no go to Saga. They have no go to Saga. In Jesus name we pray Amen That is Okay let's read this last one Apostle is a prophet We will continue Complete the rest Listen When Cain killed Abel God The Bible says he's the one that sits in heaven and he rules over the earth. He sees everything. He's dominus, dominus, presence God. All right? Omnipresent God. He's everywhere. He's dominus, saying God. He knows everything. God saw Cain killing Abel. God kept quiet. 
After Abel died, God, God now said, Cain, why did you kill your brother? Where is your brother? But God didn't go see. Was he blind? Are you surprised? God knows. When Herod killed James, God was watching him. Why the plan was going on in the heart of Herod? Why the organized people were going to kill? God was watching. Time will fail me to go on and on, both in the Old Testament and in the New Testament. But when Laban was going to hurt Jacob, God met him in the night on his bed. Oh boy, let your head be correct. This one, you don't cry. He said, don't even speak a negative word to him. Ah! Thank you, Lord Jesus. What was it about Jacob that God stood up to warn his enemy not to touch him and left others to be killed? And now came after their date to come and begin to ask, why did you kill them? Lift up your right hand. Say, the man of war. The man of war. Fight my war early. Fight my war. Say that statement seven times. The man, the man of, of war, war fight, fight my, my battles enemy. early. The man of war fight my battles. Say early. it again. Man of war fight my battles early. Say it from the depth of your heart. The man of war fight my battles early. Say it like it is your own word. The man of war fight my battles early. Now say so that heaven and hell will hear you louder. The man of war fight my battles early. Sit down. Sit down. I was supposed to stop at it, but the last one came to me. Now, the Bible tells us a story about a man called Paul. You know Paul? The one that wrote to the majority of the New Testament. A convert who never saw Jesus Christ but became an apostle by a revelation. Praise God. The Bible said, I think it's chapter, is this chapter, I can't remember the particular chapter, where they gathered him and they stoned him to death. And in order to make sure that he died well, after they have stoned him, and their doctor confirmed and said, he has died, but this kind of guys, the way they live, all these people that say they follow that man, we don't understand. Let's kill him properly. They now dragged him on the stone. Dragged him, dragged him, dragged him, dragged him to be sure that he died well. So when they now confirmed and say, true, true, the man has died well, they left him. But don't forget that before they tried to stone Paul, of course, after they did this and they left, some other group of people came and surrounded Paul. They didn't pray one prayer. They didn't say in Jesus' name. The Bible said they surrounded Paul and Paul got up. They su Should we go to scripture? Sir? They surrounded him and he got up. Now listen to me. Every relationship, because it was people that surrounded Paul that killed him. And other people that surrounded him, he came back to life. Any relationship any entanglement this year that will bring me down. Oh God, scatter them in the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer in just 20 seconds. Open your mouth and pray. Every kind of relationship that will bring me down, that will pull me to my water low. This year, oh God, scatter them on fire. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. Now listen. It was stone that killed Stephen. The same stone killed, could not keep all. Why? Let me make it a prayer, a prophecy for you. What is bringing others down may he never bring you down. Yeah. But I'll leave you with this word as I go. Stephen died because there was no mandate over his life. Paul couldn't die because there was a mandate over Paul's life. If you are lazing around in the kingdom, 
It's only God that mercy on you. Wake up from your slumber. God bless you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want us to take the second part of that prayer. I said, some people surrounded him and he died. So we pray that whoever we surround us and we aspire should scatter my right. I wanted to pray all those that will surround me and I will get up. And I will start shining. Oh yeah. Come by fire. Begin to come. Fire prayer, whatever you are. Let come. Everyone that will surround me. And my life will rise. My life will rise. And I'll become a great man. And I'll become a great man. And I'll come back to life. And I'll come back to life. And I'll become who God wants you to be. And I'll become who God wants you to be. I command you to start coming. 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 Surround me this year. Surround me this year. Surround me in February. Surround me in February. Surround me in March. Surround me in April. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in September. Surround me in October. Surround me in November. Surround me in December. Surround me in January. Surround me in February. Surround me in March. Surround me in April. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in September. Surround me in October. Surround me in November. Surround me in December. Surround me in January. Surround me in February. Surround me in March. Surround me in April. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in September. Surround me in December. Surround me in January. Surround me in February. Surround me in March. Surround me in April. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in September. Surround me in December. Surround me in January. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in September. Surround me in December. Surround me in January. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in September. Surround me in December. Surround me in January. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in August. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in July. Surround me in May. Surround me in June. Surround me in
because I'll be speaking on the power of seduction in marriage. The positive power of seduction. Because many marriages are no longer enjoying um, bliss and they are no longer enjoying the other things, the condiments of marriage. You know? I have to use those words because it's for elders. If you are not yet married, go and marry. Uh, I said, thank you. So that you can understand what we are talking about in parables. So, for you to enjoy those condiments, you need that power. So, I'll be talking about how to switch it on and off by time. So, it's for only married people. And you must register. It, they will admit you by register. If they don't see your name on the list, they won't admit you. You can spread the news to all married people. In fact, they will ask you questions on the form. It's already posted on our platform, on our WhatsApp platform. So, pick it up and answer it. They will ask you questions to know if you are married or not. If you are married, you'll be registered. Then, on that day, as soon as I come on, they'll begin to admit you according to the information you give. But if you refuse to give the information, they will block you and buy you. You won't be able to enter that zoo. Because it's strictly by registration. You don't need to pay. No payment. Maybe God tells us that you should pay later. I will make you go pay by fire. But now he has not told us to pay. So, use it well. And God will bless you in Jesus' name. Prepare for the convention. It will be awesome in this place. We shall be in our new auditorium that should be 29 days from today in the name of Jesus Christ to so prepare for it. Alright, let us take our communion right now. Father, we declare this now, the body and the blood of Christ in the name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let it strengthen us. Let it cause the covenant you have with us, the 21 covenants, to flow in full force. And Father, remember the main prayer point today that our helpers will not come after we have died. They will come while we are still very healthy and alive. While the helps will, will be appreciated. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Everybody say Amen. Pastor Duncan, can I have you here, sir? Where is Pastor Grace? So you carry it and hold it until we are ready. As you take your stand, this is the closure of the fast. What I'll do in the night is prophesying. So connect. I'll be downloading as God gives me inspiration. Prophetic release. That's what I want to do by 12 midnight. So just go eat well now. Don't let sleep carry you away. die before your time. Anybody can be wasted this year, not you. Have you taken yours? Anybody can be wasted this year, but not you. This covenant will work for you. In this church, we live long. We don't die any house. That is a lie. We don't. Eleven years, everybody is still intact. In this church, sickness does not have power over us. Sickness respects us. It doesn't trouble us anyhow. When it comes, it dies naturally. It regrets it came. When it regrets. And that's what will happen to you. All the covenants that I entered on behalf of everyone that God will send up, you know, across the globe following my destiny. May those covenants work for you. In the name of Jesus Christ. For I have received of the Lord that which I delivered to you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which you were betrayed, took bread. And when they had given thanks, he break it and said, Take it. This is my body, which is broken for you. This do in remembrance of me. After the same man also took the cup when they stopped, saying, This cup is the New Testament in my blood. This do as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. 
as often as he eat this bread and drink this cup, he do show the Lord's death till the come in the name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Go on. Begin to pray. Let the covenant come to pass in my life. And remember the main point tonight. My helpers will not come after I have died. Go ahead, fire prayer. My helpers will not come after, after I have died. Let all the covenant that God had with us in this ministry be operational. Operational in my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Operational in all that concerns me. Mazoka Lagara. Eka Tuka Braga Doshe Garuzahan. Oreke Lagara. Masuka Taka Braga Doshe Garuzahan. Oreka Lagara Garaba. Isoko Logorogoro. Maraka Lagaraba. Isoko Logorogoro. Lord Jesus, let your covenant come to pass in my life. In my life, let it happen. Let it take place. Let it take place. Let it happen. Let it find expression in my life. But Lord, I decree my helpers will not come after I've died. They are coming now in the mighty name of Jesus. They are coming right now. Maroka Lagaraba, Ekatoko Brokodoshe Garusa. Let it be your God. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you for closing this session well with us. We are very grateful. Thank you, blessed Savior. Do us good and do us well. Blessed be your name forever. In Jesus' name we pray. You may be seated briefly. Let's get our offerings. Now, what you do is this gather a sacrifice and bring to God's presence on Sunday in order to seal this. Uh, Pastor Gospel was saying that God asked him to tell us to bring a thousand dollars. As much as God has put in your heart, do it. Do it. Carry it down and let God remember you. Alright, let's give our offerings using the pay bill 821-430. 821430. Those in diaspora, you can use the Send Wave app. You can take a photograph of the church account number and send in your seat. need an envelope, raise your hand, they will give you you have a, your card, you want to use your card everybody can give up, it's easy you have your bank card, lift it up you bring the machine to you and that's all it settles that matter 821430 Let us pray. Our Father, we thank you for everyone giving. Put your breath upon every offering given. Because today is a special day here. Let special answers begin to come in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Surprise us financially. Let the surprises begin right now. Surprise us in a way we've never seen surprises before. Let the surprises be uncommon and awesome to the glory of your name. Thank you, blessed Savior. In Jesus' name we pray. If you have yours physically, you can step forward and drop it. If you have yours physically. Step forward and drink. Let's rise to our feet. What do we say to Pastor God's power? God bless you, sir. We are very grateful. Thank you for showing up. He was not the only one that had the opportunity to come. The Bible says many are called, but few are chosen. 
when I prayed and I asked God, who are those that are supposed to come and support me this time? Because I read my Bible, the Bible says, when if a man planted a vineyard, you know, he puts people there. But when the time for harvest came, he sent people to come and help the harvest. Instead of the man that was inside the vineyard to receive them, he started killing them. He sent his son also to come and help, and they killed his son. Whenever God sends people to you, it's because your harvest has come. If you kill your harvesters, you soon die hungry. So I told God, who are those that should come? And I said, bring your brothers, sons of the same father. I have plenty of them. So I reached out to all of them. Some give me excuses. One told me, I can't come until after March. I said, fine. If another one told me, in fact, I'm coming. If I sent his picture, you see his picture there. In fact, anything for the apostle, I'm on my way, I'm coming. I sent for him. He said, I'll try my best and I'll make it. Another one come, came and said, You must pay my flight. In fact, you must pay half of my flight. I said, Oh, God, I'm not a I need you to build here. <laughs> so each with different excuses. But he said, I'm on my way, I'll try my best. And God brought it. As simple as that. That's all. Um, somebody said, the others that didn't come, maybe you didn't hear God. I said, no, overhearing God is worrying me. Many are called, but few are chosen. Didn't God, he also hear when, when he sent Jesus and they didn't receive him, and they, he, he gave back to him in the manger. They gave back to him in the manger. Was God deaf? <laughs> God was not deaf. He was sent to Israel so he can redeem Israel. And Israel can now rule the whole world. Now, they rejected him, so he spread the anointing to the, to the entire uh, Gentile nation. Are you understanding? So I had very clearly bring your brothers, sons of the same father. And I began to send for them. But it has pleased God to make him the one to show them. Stretch your hand towards him. The job is over. The fasting is over. He's on his way back. <laughs> job done, man. Job done. Well done, sir. Job well done. Stretch your hand towards him. And it carries the grace of East Africa. Now listen. When I came to East Africa, God said to me, start the church arm. I didn't like it because I had more followers in Nigeria and I don't know nobody in Kenya. We just came. So I told God, sir, let me start from where they know me. And then the church in Nigeria will grow and they will come and plant branches. God said, no, sir. The sun rises from the east. You are rising from here. And that's why I'm rising from here. Sir. The sun rises from the east. Father, let the anointing of sunrise rest upon him. Go ahead. Fire prayers. Pray for him. Let the anointing of sunrise rest upon him. He gets back to Nigeria to start rising like a superstar. He gets back to Nigeria to start rising like the sun in his brightness. In the mighty name of God, he gets back to Nigeria to start rising. Zokata kabragadoshe garuza. Marekata kabragadoshe garuzata. As he steps into Nigeria, let the sun begin to rise. Let that anointing of sunrise come upon him. Let the anointing of sunrise rest upon his destiny. Let the anointing of sunrise, the anointing of sunrise that have come upon my own destiny, let it rest upon him. Remember him, O oh God. Raise him and let him start manifesting. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, let it be so in his life. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. I said, I can pick the microphone and pray for him before I close it. Our Father and our God, we are grateful for bringing a servant in the house. Ben. We thank you for his obedience. For you says, if they are willing and obeyed, they shall eat the good of the Lord. As he leaves Kenya, let him enjoy the goodness of the Lord in Nigeria. Amen. We lift him before you. Let him go and others follow. Let him start shine in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, let him carry the good of the Lord of Kenya. Yes. That you over God, you expand as, as Jabez expanded. Let him expand above his brothers. Yes. We thank you and give you praise. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Father, answer him. Every prayer request he presented here, answer him. Father, he came with the building plan of his ministry to tap the anointing here. Let that anointing follow him. Amen. In one year, 
make him an amazement amen surprise him amen give him surplus amen provision amen. more than he can believe amen. that he will have to hire managers to manage the money and the resources amen in the name of jesus christ make the edifice a beauty to behold and let it be that by this time next year we shall be right there in nigeria to dedicate his amen. buildings let it be so oh god amen bless his children bless his marital destiny amen bless his life and reward him amen. say thank you to him on our behalf thank we might not be able to remunerate him enough but lord let him keep reaping the heavens for the rest of his life because of this journey that he came even in the midst of the pandemic father he had believed in my destiny let men believe in his own destiny amen raise men to stand by him amen thank you father thank you in jesus name we pray amen. everybody say amen. amen we appreciate you sir come and put your hands together and appreciate pastor god's power on noah we appreciate you sir thank you for believing in us even while we are still trying to do gragra but god will take us to where he promised us in jesus name see you shining I will soon be where you are to come and bless all the buildings that God will give you in Jesus' name. The grace for sunrise has followed you, sir. You will rise to set no more. Your destiny will be sunshine even in sunset. When others are going down, you'll be going up. When they think it's over with you, you just emerge. When they think your chapter is closing, you will emerge. So shall it be. You will never know sunset till Jesus comes I prophesy it deliberately into your life you will never know sunset till Jesus comes Amen. in Jesus name amen. everybody say amen I release blessings on you let us meet on zoom 12 midnight I will prophesy when I see you on zoom I prophesy when I don't see you no prophecy for you <laughs> so I appear on zoom 12 midnight to 1 a.m. I prophesy of course, the pray morning prayer will still be there 4 a.m. to 7 a.m. The morning prayer is about prophetic service is 12 midnight to 1 by the grace of God. Let's share the grace in fellowship. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever and ever and ever. Amen. God bless you. Can we welcome this man from Lamu? This man came all the way from Lamu to come and join us for service. He came two days ago. Appreciate it. Lamu. Lamu was the first place I went to by prophecy. I was in University of Nairobi, Lower Kabete Campus. When I saw L A M U in the air rolling. So I asked, What is L A M U? They answered me, It's Lamu. I said, What is Lamu? They said, It's a place. A place where is the place? Somebody ran out and said, I'm from there, I'm from there. So I ministered to her. God said, That's not the end. Go to Lamu. That's when we went on our first mission to Lamu. They have beaches. beaches. Uh -huh. Yes. Wonderful. And that Lamu is the first place we are giving landed property. 1.4 acres. We have 1.4 acres of land. Yes, yeah, that's the church. <laughs> you saw it correctly. Hallelujah. So, you know, I've gone there. There were 18 churches there. We gathered together. We had a major meeting there. And God's presence came down. That was the beginning of missions in this church. You know, we give God praise. God bless you. Thank you for coming all the way from Lamu. In my pastor, don't can they drove down here? God bless you. May your work prosper there. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. So are you going tomorrow? By weekend? Alright. May the hand of God rest upon you. May it be well with you in that land. As you have started making disciples, may God raise you as a superstar. May your light shine like the sun in its brightness. In Jesus' name. Everybody say Amen. Alright. The Lord bless you. Have a wonderful night. In Jesus' name. See you on Thursday and I see you in the middle of the night. God bless you.